click the link below or go straight to MrLocario.com to get the documentary Game Kings, The Definition of Game. Yo, yo, what's going on? What's poppin'? It's your boy, Mr. Locario, the bad boy of the dating game. What's good? So the other day, I was on my dude O'Shea Duke Jackson's channel. You guys need to check out his channel. O'Shea is the truth. You feel what I'm saying? And he had my dude Steve the Dean on there. And Steve and him was talking about, you know, black men going overseas to, you know, uh, get women and all this other stuff. And basically, it was talking about how, you know, black men are tricks and simps for going overseas and all that other stuff. And Steve made a lot of great points. So I'm gonna leave the link to that uh, video below this video so you guys can check that out. Now, what I wanna say in this video is this, is that I actually support, I actually support guys going overseas to try to get women. You understand what I'm saying? I support you guys. Because see, th there's this narrative that like dating coaches or whatever, you know, like, oh, they don't want us to go over there because that's going to take away from their business. First of all, that's bullshit because a lot of you guys aren't even our client base. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? And the reason why I'm saying this is that the game is not for everybody. You understand what I'm saying? It's not for everybody. So the guys who, the type of guys who would go all the way overseas to try to get some pussy, the game ain't for you. Now, let's bring this back a little bit first. Let's, let's, let's rewind a little bit. Let's talk about game first, all right? Let's talk about having game, right? See, having game means that you have a strategy to get what you want, right? So basically everybody has game if you're gonna you know, look at it that way, right? But I always say, is your game weak or is your game strong, right? So usually weak game is synonymous with having no game, you understand? Strong game is synonymous with having game, right? But essentially everybody has game, but essentially everybody has a strategy to get what they want. So if your strategy to get women is to fly overseas to do it, then fuck it, that's what you do. But understand that's weak game, right? And this is why I'm saying the game is not for everybody because everybody does not actually wanna have strong game or they're not strong enough to have strong game. You understand? Or they don't wanna put in the work to have strong game, right? And see, I'm talking as a person who's actually went overseas who's dealt with women overseas, right? So I'm not just talking out my ass, you understand what I'm saying? And I live here in United States in Brooklyn, New York, right? I went overseas, messed with girls over there, right? And so what a lot of these guys don't understand is this, is that if you don't really have strong game, if your game is weak, if you're not a dude who really has game, that's not going to help you when you go overseas. It's not gonna help you. See, what you have to understand is this, what happens is that when you go overseas and you're you're able to interact with some of these women and make shit happen, it's because they see you as a trick. This is what guys don't understand, right? They see you as a trick. Now, what doesn't make sense to me is this. Why go overseas when you can just be a trick right here in America? You understand what I'm saying? And save yourself uh, a plane ticket. That, that's the part that I don't get. See, guys want to uh, you know lie to themselves and make themselves think that women overseas actually are sexually attracted to them and like them, which is not true. They're fucking with you because they look at you as a trick because they're like, oh, this guy's from America. He must have money. And so I want to latch on to that guy so that I can get money from him. Because a lot of times when guys go overseas, what they're doing is that they're paying for pussy, right? They're not, they're, understand this. You're not gonna be a guy who has trouble getting girls here in America and then go overseas and be this Mac, this fucking Don Juan, this fucking player ass motherfucker, it ain't gonna happen. You see what I'm saying? It's not how it works, right? So what's, what happens is when you go overseas, the women in certain you know countries in certain situations, they're poor, and so they're out there hoeing, right? And so these guys are getting women that they gotta basically trick off, right? So the thing is, these guys are tricks. Now, again, if, you, if you're if you a trick, that's cool. Just accept the fact that you're a trick. Just come to terms with that, and that's cool. You understand? And this is what I'm saying. Look, see, when I say I support it, what I'm saying is I support men doing whatever they wanna do, right? I actually don't necessarily condone tricking because I think that shit is lame um, because I'm like, why would you pay for something that you could get for free? I mean, whatever, 
Um, but dudes want to be that. Dudes want to do that. You understand? But my thing is, if you're gonna trick, why go all the way over to another country to trick when you can just trick right here? If I if I have a, a you know if I want to get a loaf of bread and I have a store down the block from me, right? Why would I go a hundred miles to another store to get bread when I got bread right there? You understand what I'm saying? That just that's the part that don't make sense to me, right? Now a lot of these guys want to delude themselves to think that these women are actually into them, which is not true. Right. I, I did a video a while ago. Where I was talking about sexual attraction versus relationship attraction. Right. See, these hoes overseas, they don't not they ha they don't have sexual attraction for you. You understand what I'm saying? Which is why you got to pay. If a woman has sexual attraction for you, you do not have to pay. You understand what I'm saying? And so if you have a hard time having uh, getting women to be sexually attracted to you, you know, in America, where you're from, you're also going to have a hard time getting women to be sexually attracted to you overseas. The thing with the women overseas is they have so much game that they make you feel like that you are, you know, the guy they want. They'll sell you that dream. They'll give you that sort of energy. You understand? Listen, when I was in Brazil, right? I was in Rio chilling, you understand? And there was a, a few chicks I fucked out there. And this is the funny part. Some of those chicks were actually hoes. But guess what? They fucked me for free. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? I actually didn't have to pay them. And the reason why I didn't have to pay them because they were sexually attracted to me. You see what I mean? And so what happens is that I'm sexually attracted. I'm sexually attractive to women in America. Women in America actually like me. And so when I go overseas, those women like me. You understand? Because all across the world, women are going to be sexually attracted to certain guys, and then they're going to be attracted to other guys because they have resources. A lot of the guys who go overseas is because they have the resources and that's why the women gravitate to them. You understand what I'm saying? And so a lot of dudes got to understand that aspect of the game and see what happens is this. A lot of these dudes, because they're having trouble with these women right here, it's it's really not actually about sex. If, if we want to be honest with you, you know, let's let's go deep. A lot of these guys want to be loved, but they go overseas because they get a different type of treatment from certain women and they are, you know, mistaking that treatment for actual affection and love and, 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 and the woman liking them and 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 being like, you know, uh, receptive to their masculinity or whatever it is. Right. But what it is, is that these women know how to make you feel that, like that. Do you understand what I'm saying? Because they know you got the paper. <laughs> you, you, this is this is real simple. Now, again, the reason why I say I support it is because I know a lot of these guys, they're not going to really step up their game. So it's what it is, what it is. You understand what I'm saying? A lot of these guys are going to continue to try to do this stuff. The funny part is some of these guys actually aren't even going to travel. They're, they just like the idea. They like talking this stuff. They're not actually going to go get the plane ticket, go to some spot. They, a lot of these dudes are scared to go overseas. If we're going to be real, <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? They're scared to do it. A lot of these dudes who talk about traveling overseas have, have never actually traveled over there. And a lot of the guys who have, they are out there tricking you understand? But they don't want to talk about that part. They don't want to talk about the tricking part. And then what they'll do a lot of times to justify it is they say, oh, well, you got to pay somehow. You're always going to pay for some shit. No. But again, I'm, I'm telling you right now, dating coach Mr. Locario supports you guys who want to go overseas and get it cracking. You understand? Because the game is not for everybody. It's not for everybody. You understand? Now, for the guys who the game is for, right? What you can expect is when you are dealing with women, right? And they're going to find you sexually attractive because you actually have game. Your game is strong. You're going to have women who want to deal with you, have sex with you, uh, be with you, date with you, date, you know, around with you and all this other stuff. And you're not going to have to pay a dime. You understand? They're not going to be using you for your money. In fact, sometimes these women will try to give you money. They'll try to do things for you so that you can stay in their life. Because see, what happens is, is that there's a, 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 a shortage of masculine, attractive men for women. See, the, 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 the type of guy most women want is a guy who hits on all cylinders. So that's a guy who they're sexually attracted to and he has resources, right?
But usually a woman gets one or the other. They get she gets a guy who's sexually attractive but has no resources or a guy who has resources but he's not sexually attractive. See, the latter is usually the guys who go overseas, the guys who have resources but they're not sexually attractive. You understand what I'm saying? And so what happens is, is that, you know, the woman usually has to choose one or the other, but she wants the combination of both guys. You see what I'm saying? But see, if you're a guy who has game, you understand? You are going to usually be a combination of both guys, or at least a guy who's sexually attractive. You understand what I'm saying? So you won't have to pay for sex. So you won't have to travel to try to get sex. You see what I'm saying? And so again, a lot of these dudes, right? The game ain't for them. And it's cool. It's not for everybody. So again, for the guys who the game is for, right here, you guys, you guys come right here. You understand what I'm saying? And we could get this shit popping. Now, for all you guys who are going overseas, I wish you a safe trip. <laughs> Click the link below and get your bad boy gear. Get the t-shirts, submissive women are sexy, binary as fuck, and I'm God to these hoes. Click the link below to get your bad boy gear today. Now, before you go, click the link below and go to badboymembership.com. Now, badboymembership.com is a place where you go to get 45 through 90 minute audio and video dating advice tutorials every month. Listen, I know you're tired of being rejected. Go to badboymembership.com. I know you're tired of being afraid to approach women. Go to badboymembership.com. I know you're tired of not getting the women that you want. Go to badboymembership.com. Listen, I know you're tired of being alone on a Friday night. Go to badboymembership.com. Now picture this. You'll go from not getting what you want when it comes to you dealing with women to actually getting what you want, to being the guy women want to be with, women want to date, women want to have sex with. All you need to do is go to badboymembership.com, follow the steps, learn the game, implement the game, and then you will get the woman you want. Make sure you go to badboymembership.com today. Click the link below.